Hey what's up guys, in this video I will be showing you how to install Android L on your Nexus 5. So guys this is like installing a custom ROM on your Nexus 5. That means this tutorial is very simple to follow. So this is not the final version but basically everything is working fine. So if you want to try Android L on your Nexus 5, this is the tutorial you need to follow. So the requirements are you must be rooted and should have a custom recovery installed. If you don't know how to do that, download the toolkit from the link one in the description and follow the instructions. Next, make sure you backup everything before proceeding since you will be losing all your apps and data. Now hit link 2 from the description, that will take you to this page from where you can download the Android L zip file. This is a flashable zip via the recovery, download it and transfer this file into your internal memory. Once done, turn off your device. Once the device is off, hold the down volume and the power button at the same time until you get into the bootloader mode. Over here use your volume keys to navigate and power button to select. So select recovery and press the power button. This will take us to the recovery mode. Once you are on your recovery mode, go to wipe, go to advanced wipe and here choose Dalvik cache data and cache and swipe to wipe. Once done, go back, go back, back again and now go to install and select the zip file that you have copied earlier and swipe to install. So guys this will take some time just be patient and I will be back with you once this is done. Ok guys the installation is complete, hit reboot system now. So guys the first boot will take some time you know from 5 to 7 minutes, don't worry just be patient. So as you can see you also get the new boot animation from the Android L. Ok we have successfully installed Android L on the Nexus 5. Let me just skip the basic setup. So guys as you can see we have the new back button, home and the recent app button. New icons for app drawer and the settings menu. Quickly going on to settings. Uh, so as you can see here we have a complete new UI for the settings menu. Very elegant, very minimal. So let's go on to about device and as you can see right now I'm running the Android L. Now let's check the notification panel. So you do get the new notification panel where you have all your toggles hidden and you need to pull this to get all your toggles else you can tap here. So that's good notification panel kind of looks cool. We even get the tab style recent apps, new dialer, keyboard and the lock screen. More on it in the review video. So guys calling, texting, Wi-Fi, camera everything is working fine. We even do get the new lock screen with Android L. So guys I will be covering all this in my full review of this ROM very soon. Stay tuned to watch that video and you guys have a great time.